All right, thank you, Bree. Well, it's Thrifty Thursday, and once again, we're going to show you how you can feed your family of up to six for under $10. Pretty good deal. And the next one is perfect for fall because we've been talking a lot about soup here on GMI. Jessica Hacker is joining us once again to give us the recipe and, of course, that price breakdown. Jessica, thanks mm -hmm. for joining us again. Good morning. And we've been excited talking about crock pots because, especially <sighs> as Bree has talked about the cold fronts that have already come through, mm -hmm. crock pots are the one of those things you want to just zap on. They are, and they're the best way, especially for working families, mm -hmm. it's the best way to have a warm, delicious, home-cooked meal. When and that's what home. we're doing today, right? And it is. Yep, this is done in the crock pot. Um, ham and beans is one of my favorites. And I'm pretty sure it's like the cheapest meal I know how to make. I mean, okay. it's crazy cheap. Uh, beans are extremely cheap, obviously high in protein, which is great, um, and fiber. Uh, they'll cost you about 89 cents a pound. And, you know, I picked these up on a good sale quite a few months ago. But if you're not, buying bulk is going to be the best way to go. Of course, Winco, you know, they have a great bulk section. So you're going to pick them up a lot cheaper. Uh, for this recipe, I'm doing two pounds. And your, you know, ham, that's another thing. I personally already had some still in the freezer, so I just picked up a couple extra ham hocks. Mm -hmm. These are really cheap, extremely okay. cheap, and you'd be amazed at how much meat. And really why you want the ham hocks is for the extra flavor. Okay. So that's what's really good. Otherwise, you, you still want other ham to actually have in chunks, You right? do, right. yeah. You still want that meat in there. Um, but otherwise, even just pick up a ham. Um, you know, really need about two pounds for this recipe. If you can't find a two-pound ham, even if your store has a butcher, you can have them cut in half for you, and they'll do that. And they'll cut it to size and repackage it. Four-pound one, now I can already have it portioned out for me. So, yeah, <laughs> super easy. Um, but otherwise, your beans. Um, some people like to soak them ahead of time. I personally usually don't plan ahead that well, and I'm kind of too lazy to do it, really. So um, I don't. I do rinse them, but put, throw them in the crock pot with enough water to submerge the beans and all your ham that's been chunked up and thrown in there okay. with the bones. Um, and just let it cook on about medium high for eight hours and come home and voila, you have a Do you put any meal. spices in there? Or? The only thing I like to add is about half the onion. I'll cut up an onion and I'll put half that onion in the soup with it while it's cooking. And so a lot of the flavor is going to come from the curing of the ham and mm -hmm. within the bone. And then I just save the, the rest of it and you know, just sprinkle some on top and you're good to go. Awesome. Smells good. I know, it's delicious. Yeah, and it looks delicious as well. And of course, you want uh, some type of side to go with it as well. Also not going to break your pocketbook when you are making some cornbread, right? Yeah, cornbread is really cheap. I personally really love Jiffy. I, you, I mean, at most, you'll spend 50 cents for a box of that. Right. right. With an egg and a third cup of milk. And you have cornbread. So even honey butter, I, you know, mm. spice up your butter a little bit. That's the best. Just add a little bit of honey to soften butter, mm. and it's very, very good. I know that. That sounds good. Yes. Yeah, and so get those crock pots turned on. because We've got that recipe for you there. We'll also have it on our website, IdahoOnYourSide.com. And, uh, yeah, don't have to plan ahead a whole lot, like you said. No. Just enough to turn the crock pot on in the morning. That's right. Get everything done. And then, yeah, you can go to work and come home to nice mm -hmm. beans. And this has been the cheapest meal we've had, about six yeah, and a half Yeah, six dollars. Yeah, it cost about a dollar seven a serving. I mean, that's, wow. that's yeah. extremely cheap. And, yeah. and I'm guessing, too, you probably have plenty of leftovers. If you use a big crock pot and everything with all those beans, you probably have lots oh, of leftovers. Oh, yes. Right? That's why I don't have the crock pot here, because my husband already stole it and took it to work with it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much. It smells good. Go ahead and make that recipe this week perfect for it, because it's a little bit cold outside.